name is Molly Curran, uh, and I'm here on behalf of Woods Hole Oceanographic Institution on the SEA Sea Education Association Corps with Kramer. Um, so we are out here with a handful of students from all over the place, and the trip is focused on robotics. So myself and Fran Elder are here uh, to teach the students about robotics and deploying in the ocean while partnered with the awesome crew of uh, SEA uh, and them showing us the ropes around the Corps with Kramer. Uh, so we've got two vehicles here today. Uh, one of them is more off the shelf. It's uh, Blue Robotics Blue ROV. Um, and the other is a vehicle developed uh, at the Oceanographic Institution. We call it OXRO, short for Auxiliary ROV. So the idea behind the vehicle is really that it bridges the gap between these highly maneuverable ROVs and these highly uh, mobile autonomous vehicles. Here on the Kramer, um, we will be deploying both robots. Uh, we'll be getting the blue ROV in the water to have the students pilot it um, and really get a hands-on experience of what it's like to be uh, an ROV pilot and to deploy something like this off of a sailboat. We'll also be putting Ox ROV in the water, see how it handles, and uh, if we can really get um, some good maneuverability and some high speed runs out of it. Is that we lost comms. It'll be great to you know, do that with the students around so they can join in on that excitement and see what it, it is like to test something for the first time. And um, I'm sure things will go wrong and we'll have to work through some challenges, but that's what it's all about. Um, so I love working with students. I think it's, it's really important at this phase of their life to uh, see the opportunities that exist, um, see what engineering is like and, and you know all the different types of things that can go into engineering and how exciting it can be. And it's not just sitting behind a desk uh, designing things. It's so much more than that, especially when you are involving the ocean, which is constantly changing. Facing that fierce ocean and, and designing things that can withstand that is really hard and really exciting. <laughs>